Hey everyone, it's Priscilla here. I wanted to share some goodies I have been purchasing in the past couple weeks. Um, I figured I'd just do it all in one shot. And I did purchase some more stuff online. I've been doing a lot of online shopping. But um, some of the stuff is from Michaels and from Marshalls, which I had um, an excellent find in Marshalls. Oh, I can't wait to show you that. But anywho, for Joann's, I purchased online. Um, at the time, they were doing 99 cents shipping, and I think that was last week or the week before. I think I purchased it, not last Friday, the Friday before. But I purchased this paper pad. This one is the uh, Countdown to Christmas. Um, it comes with 30 sheets, and these are all the sheets um, designs it comes with. So it's really cute, and that is from Melissa Francis. So I purchased that. And then I purchased these, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> goodness, I'm not too crazy about these, but I haven't opened it up yet, but um, this is from Betty, uh, excuse me, Ru Ruby Rocket, and it's 25 Days of Christmas. This are, these are the die cuts, it comes with 328 pieces, I mean, for the price, you couldn't beat it. I forgot how much I paid, but it was cheap, really cheap. So that's all the papers it comes with, and, or the die cuts. And then this is the papers itself. It's 12 by 12 sheets. Um, <clears throat> and uh, it comes with 12 sheets. And then these are all the papers as well. And they're double-sided, which is good. Because I have a project idea in mind for that. So that was just a few things that I purchased at Joann's. And then for Michael's, I purchased this, I think, a couple on Friday, I think it was. I want to say, if not earlier, but I purchased these um, envelopes. These are the long ones, the nine and a half um, by four, pretty much, and for a mini album that I'm going to be working on. I purchased this paper pack, which is really cute. Um, the Haunted Manor Recollections paper pack comes with 48 sheets, and they have such really cute uh, papers in here. So I'll have an idea for this also for a mini album. And then I purchased some of these um, dimensional stickers. Um, I purchased a couple of these uh, die cuts. These were only a dollar at the time. Here's another one too. Um, I, like I said, it, I was a little bit, probably a little bit more than Friday that I purchased it. And these were all 99 cents at the time, so I got a few for the mini album that I want to do. I wanted to do like a kitty kind of Halloween mini album, nothing too scary, more fun. And then I purchased these, which I love these. These are like the frames that they have the two faces. One is a skull, and then one just a regular portrait. So I got this. That was also on sale. And then this. This was, at the time, I think it was $0.75. Cents. Um, some red trim for a Christmas album I'm doing. <clears throat> and then let's see if I could do this in enough time. We've got like five minutes left in this video. But these are the stuff I purchased at, um, uh, what is it called? Marshall's. And please stay tuned to the very ending of the video because I have a surprise for you guys. But one of the things I found, which I am so happy, is the EK Success, the medium punch, but it's a pumpkin. And this was only $2.99, so I couldn't pass this up. Um, I like how they did the double like layering with the pumpkin to make it 3D. So I wanted to try that. That was only $2.99. I did purchase some of these Jolie's Boutique um, dimensional stickers and I purchased if you can see it. this one I love this one these are like the picture frames and I love this one the haunted house kind of looking with the little jewels hanging um, the little witch these were only a dollar forty nine I wish I found more of these but I only found one and then I found two of these these are like the keys haunted keys and these are also a dollar forty nine then I purchased this these were the Martha Stewart stickers. Um, they're really cute, the little stars, and they say eek and trick or treat Halloween. This was also a uh, dollar forty-nine. And all these paper pads. I don't think I'm gonna have enough time to put it all in one video, but I'll do it in two. But this one is the Tricks and Treats from Pebbles paper pad, and I love these paper pads. They are so cute. I like the little um, tags you can cut out. So I've been like buying a lot of Halloween stuff because I am doing a craft fair in like two weeks. So I have to like hustle and get as much done. This one, oh, this one is a pumpkin patch one from American Crafts, and all these paper pads are only $2.99 each. And 
these are all the other papers. So cute. Very full. So that's why I liked it. The pumpkins. $2.99. Then there was this one. Which I did purchase two of them. If I can find it. It is the crate paper. Um, the 6 by 6 inch pad. Which they all are. Um, this one is party day. Now this one is not open. But it has a lot of... Oops, sorry. It has a lot of pretty papers in there. I like the colors. Really cute. So there is that one. Got two of those for $2.99. And I purchased this one. This one is also from Crate Paper. It's the DIY shop. And these are have a lot of pretty colors too. I love like the subtle colors to them. Almost antique-y, vintage-y. So that's all the papers that were in that one. And then I had found another Halloween one. This one is Halloween from American Craft. And this one's not open either, but I'll just give you... Oh, it's a little open. Really cute, fun. This is more like uh, like childlike kind of papers. So I can make a little um, kid mini album with that one. And then I did purchase two of these. This is the Dear Lizzie, the Fifth and Frolic from American Crafts. So pretty. I love it. So I can't wait to play with that. I purchased two of those. And I did purchase, I forgot to show this, this large punch from EK Success. It is called the Flourish Heart Frame. So I don't know if you can see it, but it looks like that. And that was only $4.99. So I couldn't pass that up. They had other ones too. But for all my subscribers, um, if you are watching this video, and if you would like to win one of these paper pads, one is the Fifth and Frolic from Dear Lizzie that I just showed you. And then the other one is the Crate Paper Party Day. Um, just leave a comment below um, stating which one, um, if you won, which one you would like. The Dear Lizzie, the Fits and Frolic, or the Crate Paper Party Day. And um, I will do this only for a couple days. And then I'll pick the winner probably, what's today, Monday? Probably by Wednesday or Thursday, um, depending how many uh, comments are there. So I'll be giving one of these away. So, um, like I said, comment below. And then, uh, whatchamacallit, um, let's see who the lucky winner is. So thanks, everyone, for watching. And definitely check out your Marshalls, even TJ Maxx, Ross, because they have good deals on scrap stuff. I always find um, scrapbooking and paper crafting stuff in there for really cheap, like these. So um, like I said, again, thanks for watching, and I will pick the winner in a couple days. Bye.